are Trump's finances coming to light now going to affect him and his presidency and his power now? I can feel the anger of his base. They are so angry. And of course, nothing is ever his fault. And the first person who will tell you nothing is ever his fault is him. Donald himself is always, always, always the victim. How is this, all this financial stuff going to affect Trump? Trump is feeling very wobbly. Don't know why. Like shaky, like he's so upset, he's shaking. He's so angry, so upset. It's who he is. I mean, this is, this, this hits, this really hits him. <laughs> The pet, my oh. Trump would like to tell you in great detail about his electoral victory, the electoral college. Do you know? Do you know how many electoral votes he won? He would like to tell you, again, in detail, because it's nearly impossible. It's impossible. It's impossible for Republicans to win the electoral college. Center the reading. Justice. This isn't just, this isn't just going to stay in the New York Times. This is, this is not just going to be a, a, an issue of journalism. Hmm. I did shuffle. But again, the, the money that Trump got from his father and him feeling like he is helpless to stop all of these people digging into his finances is the most sensitive thing to him. I mean, porn stars, eh, you know, there's still some, he's such a, he's such a misogynist. Some of that is, well, yeah, but all my friends were jealous that I got to, you know, whatever, some virile manly thing. But this is, this hits to, does he really have the money that he says he does? And the world is really coming in. This is, this is deep emotion. This is as deep emo- it's almost about- this is about as deep as his emotions go. Near future. This feels so much bigger than just this t I really thought this article came out today and I, I just thought, yeah, okay, fine, it's a- Who cares? This base isn't gonna care. You can get away with anything. But these cards are- that's Trump himself. This is the card that comes up uh, when he's when Trump is not pretending to be emperor. So this is a huge. This knocks. This really knocks him down to size, as it were. People, I feel people. I don't know if people are laughing, but he's just screaming. People are laughing at me. People are laughing at me. These lies. These lies. He he believes. I wouldn't say necessarily he believes his own lies. It almost feels like he just decides that's what's true. So that's what's true. I'm a billionaire, I'm a billionaire, I'm a billionaire. Well, what if you're not? He is, therefore he is the end of discussion. Home environment, the government, the IRS, Mueller, investigators, New York, New York prosecutors, attorneys, really coming, you know, getting all up in his business. Hopes and fears. What other people see. Well, this is his, this is him lying through his teeth. I'm a simple, humble man. I only got it just a mere million dollars from my father when I actually got more like 14 million. And, and that's all. No, you, he was getting huge amounts of money from the time he was like three years old and he was a millionaire by the age of eight and he just got more and more and more money but he's oh he is gonna just he has convinced himself this is how it was he just decides that's how it was that's how he gets away with these lies because he just tells himself this is what's true it's, uh kellyanne conway does the same thing i've heard she even does it uh, about she'll say 
she'll, she, she'll say to herself, Kellyanne, it's not lunchtime. You're not hungry. And she'll just say it over and over until she believes it. But he's going to lie through his teeth, but all of this is happening around him. It's almost, it just almost feels like it's just, it's just movement, 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 this coming in, this, this coming in, uh, this coming in, just piling on. Final outcome. This is, this is what he shows the world with the gold, the gold drapes. But this is the flip side of the coin. This is what's actually underneath. This is, this is what the portrait of Dorian Gray actually looks like. The picture of Donald Dorian Gray. Dorian Gray Trump. Oh, he's, this, I just, I can just hear him in my head just screaming, they're stealing from me, they're stealing my money, how dare, they can't take my money, they can't, they can't take my money, they can't take my money, just screaming and screaming and, 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 screaming, yelling, top of his lungs, just, I don't know, I didn't, I didn't think the, this article was, I really didn't think this article was going to be that big of a deal, but, um, partnerships he made when he was younger. Everybody trying to calm him down. Everybody trying, trying, try. This, this is absolutely everyone is going to be doing. Everybody trying to calm down Trump. His illusions are breaking. Hide some money by sending some through Ivanka and then overseas or something. Going on a, a, a rampage of how dare they, how dare they. I mean, he's, this, this is important. I mean, this is, this is really happening. The, I mean, sorry, this is really going to happen. But this is going to be the center where everyone, his advisors, the military, the foreign dignitaries, family, everybody's going to be try, trying to calm him down. I'm the star. This is how he sees himself. Young, virile, with the weird flip of hair, and, and I'm a star, and I'm this, and I'm this, and they can't take my money, and these thieves, and these rotten, rotten people, rotten Democrats. So, and it, it, this says it's going to happen quickly, but eh, are we talking before or after the midterms? Where this really cracks. Because right now it's just a story. There's Mueller. This is before or after the midterms. It's Mueller and the investigators. Sounds like a sounds like a beach band. Mueller and the investigators. And Trump's family fortune. Mueller and the investigators going, what the heck? And looking into all of that. And just steadily working their way through, oh, just the sheer amount, the volume of stuff they've already gone through, let alone what they're going to have to go through. And and then the the Republicans still throwing up even more roadblocks to just try to stop them from looking this this feels like Ivana, or as Lena calls Ivana Trump, the mother of dragons. Over on her YouTube channel, she's great. This is the kids worrying. It's just coming in from all sides. It's it's the public. It's the different parts of the public, it's investigators, it's it's Mueller and his investigators, it's investigators in New York State, it's um, people like Manafort and Cohen and 
the, all the people who made money with him, it's, it's reaching critical mass of all of the people who have turned against him, who have bad information on him. To the point where he's going to say, all right, I'm going to make a decision. I'm going to make a decision. I'm going to, no, I'm, I'm going to, sorry, this is, I'm going to make a decision. This is going to be, I'm going to stand up. I'm going to be my, but he's, but he feels very small. He's not, he's not, he's not an emperor here. But he's, I'm going to stand, I'm going to fight. But then there's, he's going to be asked to leave the presidency. He's going to be asked to leave the presidency. And eventually, that's exactly what he's going to do. He's going to leave. He's going to resign. Well, I don't know. It, I don't know about resign. As much as... It, it, he never says he's wrong. He never says, I'm sorry. He never... He's never in the wrong. So, how could he resign? Does that make sense? Secrets. And his secrets will be the quote-unquote death of him. Death of his presidency. This is history. It feels like history books. This feels, this feels like it's in the history books right here. And this is how it will be remembered. And they'll be looking into it forever. They'll be digging down into talking to every last person who's like, look, I don't want to talk about it again. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Yeah, I knew him in third grade. Yeah, I, you know, I was his doorman. Yeah, I was, uh, please leave me alone. Quit calling. I've talked to six different people. I've talked to, uh, you know, I talked to investigators. And now just all these people always writing more and more books. I'm done. I'm done. So, well, this is, this is big. I, it doesn't doesn't look any bigger than all the other scandals, but we're, we've, we have essentially, we're reaching critical mass. Or we have, it feels more, it feels like we're tipping over now into critical mass, or we just tipped over. It doesn't feel as much in the future as much closer to now. All right. Well, let's see what happens. And thank you for watching.